Hello everyone, welcome to Begin State. In today's tutorial, I am going to show you how to run PHP code in your Visual Studio Code text editor. In order to run a PHP, you need three things. One is PHP, another one is a web server, another one is a database. I know that it will be a tedious process for you to install them separately. So it would be better you install a software that can offer these three things. So in order to find out which software will offer these three things, type PHP web server in your Google and click the first link. Here you will see the list of web servers which offers PHP web server as well as the database together. Now I'm going to choose XAMPP over these ones because XAMPP is a cross platform in the sense you can use this software in any of the operating system. So click here download and install the installation will be just simple like any other software now after installing this go to your search here type xamp control panel then you will find this one double click now you need to start the apache web server as well as the state base so initially after the installation you will see something like that now you need to click the start button to start the apache web server as well as to start the MySQL database. After this, what you need to do, you just go to your computer, go to this PC, go to your local disk C, you will see a folder name called ZAMP. Open this one, and then within this folder, you will see a folder name called HT Docs. So this is a place where we are going to keep all your PHP files. If you don't keep your PHP file within this folder, your program is not going to be executed. So keep that thing in mind. So open your HT Docs, create a folder. Let me say I'm going to create a folder here. And then I'm going to name them as, let's say, exercise. So within this exercise, let me open. Now I'm going to open this folder with my VS Code text editor. For that, select this part, type CMD, hit enter. Type CODE code space dot hit enter so that this particular folder will be opened with the Visual Studio Code text editor. Now I need to create a PHP file. So here I'm going to click. Let me call this one as an index.php. Hit enter. Write your PHP code here. For example, I'm going to write a PHP code. Let me write a simple one. So inside I'm just going to put a simple echo statement. And then I wanted to type greetings. So now I want to run this code uh, using my browser. So for that, after typing the PHP code, save this one. Go to your browser, type localhost, hit enter. It will take you to the HT Docs folder. So here I have different folders. Remember, I have created a folder name called exercise. Click this one. I'm sure that now you can able to see the result as greetings. So this is how you can use VS Code to run your PHP files. I hope this tutorial is useful for you. Don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe the channel if you have not yet. Thank you.